Right guys, so after so long with so many planning, finally we've arrived in one of the most picturesque and prettiest villages here in England. Welcome to Cotswolds! guys welcome back to my channel it can be your adventure so we've now come here in the starting point of our adventure today and we're now here in wheelchair here in Chippenham but of course this is not where our adventure is this is just a starting point because we're heading to the Cotswolds and we're heading to Castle Coombe in a while and we're just waiting for the bus that will transport us down in uh, Castle Coombe and we've got the weather really nice now it's really cold but really good sunshine down here in wheelchair and in a few minutes we're heading towards Castlecombe and we've got here my lovely wife as my travel partner this time on this adventure and stay tuned with us guys and we're gonna bring you more of our adventure today in Castlecombe so guys finally we're now here inside the bus heading to Castlecombe so this is not actually a very straightforward travel from London because from London there's a lot of modes of transportation that you can go and head to Castle Coombe. You can have a bus from London to Chippenham or you can have a train from Paddington in London and heading to Chippenham. And then from Chippenham you have to ride a bus heading to Castle Coombe, which is actually like around 20 stations, 20 stops from Chippenham. So it's only costing seven. 0.80 for both of us round trip so that's actually quite cheap if you would think about it and you can actually avail some tours but of course I don't recommend that one because you're gonna spend so much on it and you have very limited time and much better if you discover Castle Coombe or the Cotswolds on your own and with this vlog I'm sharing you all this information in order for you to also enjoy and embark on your own adventure here in Castle Coombe Before you continue watching this vlog, don't forget to click the subscribe button on my channel. It can be your adventures to get all of my life here in London and anywhere else in the world. And also don't forget to click the bell button to receive further notifications to all the vlogs that I'm going to produce on my channel. And thank you guys for being with me in all the adventures that I've been through in my channel. And rest assured guys that I'm going to continue providing you or giving you with vlogs that are exciting, fun, and inspirational. So you guys rock! Guys, we're now actually in the most picturesque part of Castlecombe. As you can see, we're actually towards the end of Castlecombe. So it's actually down the far end of the market square or the market hill. So you can see all these houses. The weave, they're, they're called the weavers' houses because of their structure. As you can see down here, it's very common designs of houses down here in Cotswolds. And this is actually the most picturesque part of this town. And if you've got the, like the chance, this is very Instagrammable. So you can take photos down here, take videos, reels, whatsoever to capture the best view of consoles. So guys, now we're actually uh, been to the end of the town where the river flows. And that's actually the most picturesque part of, the, of Castle Coombe. So we've done a couple of shots down there. And actually, it's one of the busiest. Even if we are here in the morning, there's still a lot of people coming in there to get a decent photo on that part of uh, Castle Coombe. And we're gonna show you that one, the ones that we've taken from that area. And here you go!
right, so guys, we've actually discovered one part of Kasukum and now we're heading to St. Andrew's Church here in Kasukum. So actually, this is the church, the main church down here in Kasukum. And actually, it contains the oldest or one of the oldest faceless clock that is still functional here in Great Britain. So be with us, guys, and let's go come inside. So Kasukumb is actually really nice town, very picturesque, charming, and actually like depicts a typical countryside in Greater England. So if you've got like, the opportunity or time, come and visit Kasukum to actually like experience the best of English countryside. So guys, we finally finished our lunch and we're full now and we're back on track. We're ready to explore more of Kasukum, but it's actually like a very tiny village down in the countryside here in uh, Cotswolds. But it's really nice and I think the best time for you to like go here is during autumn time, but minus the rainy season or the rainy weather. <laughs> because with us, we have to like have some pauses in between our uh, adventure because of the rain but otherwise as i said adventures are endless and will always like bring you the best in my channel <laughs> So guys, since we're here in Castle Kum, I'm gonna introduce you or I'm gonna let you see the unique houses that I've discovered here in this English countryside. Let's go! So actually, the first one is the Church View Cottage. So as you can see, there are actually vines here on the walls and they actually like resemble the season of autumn. And it's also very picturesque and we've got some snapshots down here and I'm gonna show you that one in a while. So let's go to the next one. This one is also very old. It's called the Reading Room Cottage. So I'm not so sure why it's called the Reading Room Cottage. But this area is actually one of the most picturesque as well. And it's leading to where the river is. So let's go. Look, as I can see, Coombe Cottage. There you go. Oh. And actually guys, there's one cottage here that is very unique because I saw a unicorn cottage. So let's just see. I'm gonna show you that one. Right, so we're now here in Gable's Cottage. And the most unique one is the unicorn cottage. There you go. So as you can see, there's a unicorn sign on the doorway. So it's actually very unique. Very interesting, very interesting English countryside town. So, there you go guys. So, this is like the long stretch of unique cottages down here in Castle Kung. So, there you go guys. Thank you so much for being with us on this adventure. I hope you enjoyed also the charm and beauty of Cotswolds. If we made this adventure fun and exciting, it can be your adventures as well! Bye!